they had a couple of big guys. Um, and, um, uh, you know, at first we were nervous again, which, which I know until we got the feel of the game and the game started rolling out, then, uh, we felt more comfortable. We thought we can do this, you know, but at first, I mean, wow. When we stepped out in the ice, we could hardly contain ourselves. We were so nervous. We were, we were 10 feet off the ice when we were skating around there. I'll tell you, we were just on t- like so energized that it was incredible, an incredible feeling. We were getting better and better every series, and we, we peaked uh, when we played Dawson Creek. We realized, holy geez, there's nothing special about these guys. There's no reason we can't take this team, you know, and we did. I think you you need to believe in yourself and believe in what you can do and uh, not listen too much to the uh, the noise that goes on around a major hockey event just stay focused stay true to yourself have confidence that that's important i think we had confidence uh, in our abilities we all believed in each other and i think that's a big factor and i think if your te- teammates support you back you up it really helps stay focused and think about what your objective is what is it you want to get get done and then get the job done. Twenty-four-seven going on here. 
Is it going to be? You're in fucking figure eights over there. I look like a, I look like a ballerina. <laughs> I was right over there and some guys just asking me to fight so I said, you know what buddy, let's do this. So I placed my gloves on the ground and I said, oh, oh. and then we both dropped it and I got my ass kicked. I scored two goals. Do I remember scoring? God, I can't even remember who scored. <laughs> there was no individual things that stood out to me. Uh, it just seemed like everybody played so damn well. There were no bad players. I can't even remember who scored because it, it, it didn't seem important at the time. The fact was the team pulled together so well and we all we all did our thing and did it well. Okay, so one thing though, guys, we're doing a good job of flanking them on the four check right there, making sure, but F3, right, you have to lock the middle. And if D goes, and F3 goes, and he's attacking the wall too, then it's open up in here, okay? So even if you're already here, and you notice that you've got two guys going deep off of a turnover, get to the middle nice and high right away, okay? And let the D go in there, because if there's a turnover, then we can keep it back in the zone. Okay,
A normal life is boring The superstar that's close to post-mortem It only grows harder Homie grows hotter He blows us all up But he's homes is all on him He goes to coast shows He's known as the globe trotter Lonely roads got him He knows he's wrong father From home he's no father He goes home and barely knows his own daughter The host he knows cause here goes the cold water These homes don't want him no more He's cold prodder They moved on to the next moment Shot. He plays it to White deep. White in. Center score! Yeah! Pond, and now Pond will chase Pond. Here comes Michael Pond. In! Makes a move! Score! Here they come, Brandon Halls. Tries a shot! Score! And Pond was hit on his way down. Nick White with a headshot. But here comes Tupper. Tupper in. Centers! Stop by Campbell! Up to White. Over to Brandon Halls. Halls waits. Holds the puck across ice. One timer deflected. Goals! Darren Halls. Halls down the right wing. The defenseman around one. That nifty move. Goals! Goals! Hamilton. Maintaining the balance. It comes up with Brandon Halls. Halls side of the net. They're scoring one time. Goals! A bouncy puck. Dug down by Lila Ball. Lila Ball has the room. Goals! Goals! Sutton blue line. Scoping. Crew. Crew. Pardon me. Dr. Crew with a shot. A loose puck. Walked into the corner, cross ice, what?
Nice win. Great win. Don't fucking. Hey, it. Goals are good.